Have you ever been put in a position where you didn't think that you had the strength to carry on? You must never give up. You felt a sense of weakness. You wasn't clear about exactly what was necessary for you to get to where you needed to be. Never means under no circumstances. Do you give yourself permission to stop? I mean, it might cross your mind, you might be tempted, but you never give in to the temptation to quit. All quitting is is a temptation and you gave in to it. There is always an upgrade tied to your pain. Your tears have not been cried in vain. Your effort is not in vain. So when you encounter a major setback, if you encounter a major roadblock, say to yourself, wow, something huge must be on the way. You didn't understand why all of these things were pulling you down. You didn't realize that you were all by yourself in this particular situation. Not realizing that you needed something to electrify your ideas, to give you a sense of hope, to give you some recognition that work needed to be done. Quitting first starts as a thought. We all get that thought. It comes across your mind, I'm tired, I should quit. We all get those thoughts. It's not just you, but in order to finish, you gotta be able to take those stop captives. You gotta be able to talk yourself into it and stop talking yourself out of it. Man, I'm tired, I should quit. That's when you talk yourself out of quitting. Elevation requires patience and endurance because it often comes packaged in the form of pain. As you get closer to your breakthrough, it may begin to look like everything is falling apart. This is the time that you must wake up and realize that giving up is not the option that you must take. You gotta have that mindset that quitting is not an option. Give up? Who me? Never. Stop? Who me? Never. That's for the next guy. That's for the next girl. But not me. Why? Because I don't quit. That ain't how I do it. That ain't how I roll. I never give up. You must understand that there will come a time in your life that circumstances are going to challenge you no matter what you do. But you must never give up. Don't let the obstacles discourage you and make you believe that it's not meant to be. Pursue when it's hard. Pursue even when it would make more sense to give up. Not you, champ. You ain't the one. Not you, kid. You ain't the one to quit. Giving up is not what you do. You got the wrong one here, baby. Until you believe that. Until you feel that. Until you live that. We got work to do. You see, quitting is a mindset. Quitting is a mentality. If you quit enough, if you quit all the time, you build a reputation to quitter. And people get confidence in your track record. And they will bet against you. He won't finish. She won't finish. You know him. He always quit. But not you. We got to flip the script. There is purpose within you. But you must never give up. What they should say is you know him, he is relentless. You know her, she is relentless. You know them, they are tenacious. Just because it's hard doesn't mean it can't be done. Yes, you're going to face some challenges, but you are an overcomer. So don't you dare sit there and drown in self-pity. Yes, I'm talking to you. You might feel stuck. You might feel trapped. But if you look for a solution, I promise you will find it. I understand that it's going to get tiresome sometimes. 
I understand you're gonna feel like quitting. I understand you're gonna give up and you're gonna wanna say you don't have it anymore. But I'm here to let you know that you got to rise up and you got to continue to push for it. And you gotta walk down that path. And if you get down, get back up. And if you're feeling alone, you're not alone for very long. You have got to find the inner beast within you because it has yet to be awakened. When you finish, my friend, you will be celebrated. When you finish, my friend, you will get your reward. Your prize is waiting on you. Your fans are waiting on you. Your respect is waiting on you. The admiration is waiting on you to finish. The race is not given to the swift or the strong, but those who endure to the end. You know, it's easy to smile and feel excited about your future when everything is going the way you want it to go. But your endurance is not tested on the mountain. It's tested in the valley. So how do you handle dark moments? You are going to walk down this long path. And this path is the unknown. And a lot of people are not ready for the unknown. Many people are looking for the way out instead of looking for the way in. When they turn you back and push you back and tell you that you can't go on because you don't have what it takes. When you start to feel empty inside, when you start to feel that you're drained, when you start to feel that you are depleted, never give up. When we look at your tombstone, my friend, they gave the date you were born and they're gonna put the day you expired and the dash is what we're talking about right now. The dash is what you're gonna be known for. The dash is what's gonna be honoring you. Can I ask you right now, how hard are you working on your dash? Your respect is in your dash. Your wealth is in your dash. Your dreams have to happen in your dash. On your tombstone, we're gonna know what year you were born. We're gonna know what year you expired. But we gotta know what's in your dash by how you live. We're gonna know what's in your dash for how you think. We're gonna know what's in your dash for how you execute. As long as there's breath in your body, you gotta work on your dash. Faith moves mountains. Many people don't have enough faith. Many people don't believe in themselves. So you hold on to giving up. Don't be that person. Don't be the one that wants to quit. Don't be the one that wants to say it's over. It's never over. If you're living right now, if you're walking above the ground, it is not over. Are you willing to work for it? Are you willing to fight for it? Are you willing to have people think that you have lost your mind because you refuse to quit? You can't give up on your dream just because your journey is frustrating you. I know the power of enduring. I know the power of following through. I know the power of persistence. Embrace the challenges. Embrace the struggles. Embrace the pain and rise above it. Carry on the torch with your head up, never looking down. Right now, you gotta get in shape physically and mentally for your moment, for your opportunity, for your window of opportunity is coming. Success requires your focus. Re success requires your heart. Success requires your passion. Never give up on your purpose. Never give up on your opportunities. Never give up on living your life. Be strong each and every day. Your biggest problem, you might be thinking, well, I ain't in first place, I'm in last place. So, sometimes you just gotta finish and let that be your victory. You can come back later and worry about what place you came in or what the score was. Sometimes the finish is the victory. 
You got to understand that. You got to get that. You got to receive that because every year we're going to get better. Every year we're going to build. Every year we're going to stack success on top of one another. I don't care what your background is. I don't care what your story is. Only you know your story. Only you know your journey. But you got to make sure you understand how this thing is made. If you want to give up, give up on quitting. Give up on excuses. Give up on I can't. Give up on trying and just go after it. Go hard. Go strong. Never give up. Never quit. This time is yours. Own it. Live it. Be it. And hold on to it with everything you got. You've come too far to give up now. And as long as you never quit, as long as you never give up, you got one fan in me, and I will always clap for you. Because the victory goes to those who finish. The victory goes to those who never give up.